Okay, here we have this triangle, vum and vum and vum. Nice right triangle. And on top of it, we have another right triangle, vum. There's my right triangle. So what do we have here in terms of points? P, S, R, and Q. What do we know? We have a root five up here. We have a two root five for Q, P. Let me draw a nice little there. That looks more like a triangle. And we have R, S is equal to three. Call them A. Area of triangle P, Q, R. In column or quantity B, we have the area of PSR. Which one's bigger? Well, this question screams out to be Pythagorean theorem. Why? Well, they give me two sides right here, right? Triangle, we want to know the third side. We invoke Mr. Pythagoras, and we get 2 root 5 squared plus root 5 squared equals hypotenuse as long as we make sure to square that side. So this is squared. I, I, I'm going to assume everyone kind of do the exponent distribution, do it at home, so I won't, I won't belabor that too much. So we get 20 over here. We square this side as well. Root 5 squared is 5. Square root of 25. So we know that PR is equal to boom, 5. Well, that's great. Boom, 3, 4, 5, just like that. No need for you anymore, Mr. Pythagoras, because we know 3, 4, 5. That's great, because now I can just say, hey, look, PSR, area is 4 times 3 divided by 2, which is 6. This guy over here is root 5 times 2 root 5. The root 5s times each other are simply 5. 5 times 2 is 10. Don't forget to divide by half, as triangles are half base times height. So 10 divided by 2 is 5. And look, winner is B.